The truck was carrying methylene diphenyl diisocyanate, uh, which has reactivity with water. At this time, uh, we have Jones County Emergency Management, Mississippi Department of Environmental Quality, U.S. Environmental Services, along with the Laurel Fire Department, Laurel Police Department, Jones County Fire Co Coordinator's Office, American Red Cross, and uh, numerous other agencies on scene. Uh, the situation is such at the time that no evacuations are necessary. However, the hospital has uh, shut down their air intake system uh, as a result of this spill as a precaution. Uh, currently, the winds are favorable, uh, which means they're actually blowing from kind of the north to the south, pushing any uh, potential fumes away from uh, you know, populated areas. Uh, the uh, U.S. Environmental Services team will be here uh, in about one to two hours, their rapid response team to begin assessing and starting the cleanup, but we're looking at an 18 to 24 hour event here at this location. Currently, uh, the hospital is, is well aware of the situation. They have, of course, shut down their intake, their air intake systems. They have procedures in place to, uh, to further uh, you know, isolate the hospital if they need to. At this time, we understand that the, the uh, actual threat at that distance is not that great. However, we are taking all precautions to ensure that uh, the public is, of course, safe and that uh, they're well informed. <laughs> 